That is right. It is time for the fair lady. My fair lady, you are going to be anally distra- I'm sorry, that's disgusting. Don't say that, you horrible bastard. Again, we're back. We're doing some more glitchy witchy mariwaris. Let's get into it. So we're going to go straight to the upgrades, go to the custom upgrades. I know there's probably a different way to go about it in like a different menu or something. It's probably a little bit quicker, but... Oh, yeah, we can put that forza kit in. I would love that forza kit. Mm -mm -mm -mm. No. What are you doing? That's disgusting. That's what we're talking about. Yes. We want the Rocky Bunny kit on there. Then we're going to back out. This is what I wanted to do because we haven't actually done the Fair Lady yet, I don't think. Which is somewhat disgusting, in my opinion, because this thing is fucking beautiful. So, we're going to install this body kit, and we're going to do the usual of back away, go to the auto shore, go to the Falls of Vista. I don't know where it is, apparently. Go to Falls of Vista, go to front bumper option there, put on body kit option, go to default, back away, abandon, and there we go. They have the option to now put on. A lot of shit. Here we go. We got from um, Hunts as well. So anyway, let's put on these bumpers. So that front bumper straight away, in my opinion, is instantly miles better. I think it looks clean AF, like cleaner than the stock one. I say that. It's got a bit more to it. I kind of like that. Then we got a light at the front if we want to. It's got three boobies. <laughs> and that's the like, oh, that's a little bit weird. It's actually, is that merge the bump? Yeah, it's merge the bumper on top of it. So I guess it looks kind of cool at the same time. Go with the Forza option, which really looks freaky. And then we got that Nissan option right there, which is the stock one, I imagine. Or, like, similar to stock. Or is that the actual... No, that's removing the front bumper. Oh, that just removes the bar. So that is actually pretty cool. That's, like, a very slight thing, but looks really awesome. Um, I kind of want to go with that. That looks... That's probably my favorite so far. At the same time, that's pretty cool. I, I kind of want the, the that. So I'm going to go with that. That looks pretty weird. But we're going to install it anyway. So let's install that. See, if the bottom of the bumper didn't stick out, it would look all right. But it looks a bit freaky, honestly. I'm not too sure I like that. But we'll find out if it's any good a little bit later. Going on to this now. This is the rear bumper. Let's change that booty. Change that boot. Oh, yes. We can put on those. That is what I want. That is pretty cool. Let's back away again. It's not really a wing, per se. Oh, those are bumpers, wasn't it? The wing we can do afterwards. So install those. Oh, this is going to look pretty awesome. Side skirt options. We have one, which adds a little... Are those foot stands or something? What the fuck is that? I'm going to put it on anyway because it adds to it. So supply that. Install. Next up is going to be the Wang, which is going to be quite interesting. Oh, the Rocket Bunny Wing looks pretty awesome so far. That, uh, that though, I actually preferred that one. It's a bit more minimalistic and cool looking. So that is what I'm going to install. That is is pretty much it i think in the visual mods i can do like uh, the glitch wise so i'm very happy with how this one's turned out i think it looks pretty awesome it's very like a mix of wait it's, it's basically the stock car in like a rally form if you will and then they've put wide flares on it which looks mwah, beautiful no wait i completely forgot there's one more option that we completely missed out so go to the front bumper i mean the the yeah the front bumper and revert it abandoned setup what i want to do is actually change the hood I need some crazy hoods. We've got hood options. We've got one hood option, which actually adds loads of fucking lights to it, which looks pretty cool. But at the same time, I kind of want to keep it clean. I want to keep it clean as possible. Oh, that blue is beautiful. So we're going to go through one or uh, two of these. Uh, that's the design we chose for the last car. Go through some of these designs again, because there are some absolutely magnificent ones in here. Oh, but I, I really enjoy putting a design on the other one. So again, I'm going to search through some of these. Go to racing. I think racing is like the easiest category to go with. I don't think there's a drifting category. Otherwise, I'd probably go with that. Because those would be the, the cool designs. But this seems to be uh, pretty cool so far. Um, That color is beautiful. I'm kind of tempted to just put that color on. Because it's really nice. And I don't know if I, if I could make like how I could make that color myself. I know I probably could. But I don't care. That is absolutely stunning on every single level. That is the one I'm going with. Thing to remember is that our bad boy is actually still stock. Now, I need to choose some really nice, like, classic style rims, I think, at the same time. Like, that's, that's what this build pretty much is. It's, like, very classic, very posh at the same time as being stance motherfucking crazy. Beautiful, crazy person's made some crazy mods for this car. But at the same time, he's gone, you know what? This needs to be classic, beautiful, pristine. I love it. I'm kind of just hoping the next glitch that we find actually lets us 
switch the rims out so the back and front would be different or all of them be different. That would be very awesome. That would be the one of the best glitches in this game. And then the gl this just just falls. I don't don't remove the glitches. Just keep them in. We'll, uh, well, well, thank you for actually keeping glitches in for once. <laughs> Here we are, friends. We're now gonna go and drop this bad boy. Oh, 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 she's dropping. She's dropping low. She's gonna twerk for us. We're not, we're not gonna make it twerk. Don't worry. All right, maybe we will. Oh, yes, baby. Give me that booty. Mm, I love it. Kind of tend to swap the engine out, but at the same time, I hate swapping out engines and the fact, like, I hate swapping out drivetrains, engines, anything for any car that I'm kind of just, like, building to, to look more cool, if that makes sense. So, have we actually got any aspiration conversion? Yes, we do. We can throw in a single turbo, so we're going to do that. And uh, then we're basically just going to upgrade this a little bit. Again, I'm probably going to stay in the A-Class with this car. I don't, like, A-Class is probably gonna be, like, my favorite area in this game because of the fact that, well... You don't really... Did I do any of the other mods? I didn't actually. I forgot to do fucking drivetrain mods. Yeah, A-Class is literally like... Oh, no, you, you do it. You're ruining me flow here, mate. A-Class <laughs> is a very comfortable area and it's not over the top and stupid. But at the same time, it gives you enough power to get where you're going in. I've become Jordy. Wait, let's have a look. For God's sake, it doesn't add anything. Oh, this is... Oh, my fair lady, you are very, very much a fair lady. Look at her. So she has become, if you saw this at a car show, you'd be like stunned by it. It sounds so good. Why have I not made this car so far? Even ignoring the fact that we've got the glitch, why didn't I make it? I think this though, this glitch makes it so much cool. Oh, this is the best sounding car in Forza. I don't care what you gotta say. Holy shit. Turbo flutter, baby. Yes. Flutter for me. Flutter the booty. That's what I don't mind. <laughs> I like how the uh, the little mud flaps at the bottom actually clip through the ground as well. Just to show you a little bit more glitch authentication. It is very much made for off-roading in that matter. But anyway, here we are. We've got a, we've got a, <laughs> we've got a comedy shorts gamer. Is he gonna comedy shorts game into a wall? Possibly. Because he's not, he's gonna see, he's gonna look at this thing and be like, holy shit, I wish I could have one of those. I have never really been a massive fan of this car, honestly. I'm, not, I'm gonna say that with my hands held up. I've never really been a massive fan. Uh, just for the reason that, like, it's just not a car that's gonna attach to me in any way. But now, oh my god! Oh, you fucking beautiful bitch! Holy shit! This is gonna be me swearing in this car all the time because I love it. That makes no sense to you. Why would you swear at a car that you love? Shut up! Don't question my logic sometimes. It's a little bit all over the place. Well, this this guy hasn't come in shorts gamered, but he's still gaining pretty well. But do you know what, mate? Doesn't matter, because I'm across the line. No, don't destroy it! It actually hurt me inside to watch that drop there in a little bit. I'm <laughs> sorry, baby. While we're here, we may as well actually try and chuck it off-road, because, again, it does have the mud flaps, meaning it should be good off-road, right? Because <laughs> that's how it works. The mud flaps just mean your uh, car is absolutely perfect at off-roading in every single way. So, let's throw it off a few ramps and stuff. That felt like it would have broken my suspension. Prob probably would have been, even if it was a rally car. Rear window sweat. Wipers activate. Oh, the, the window just dried. The wipers just magically happened, apparently. <laughs> I don't know. That is a brilliant idea, Theo. Why don't you race this rally car while you're both off-road? This guy's definitely a rally car, but we're going onto the road. It's all right. We're going to race the rally car on road. Don't, I don't mind either way. I don't know what happened to him there, but it means the fair lady can pull like a train. I love it. Come on. And I just want to let up because of the flutter. I just, <laughs> I'll probably lose a race because I want to listen to the beautiful flutter of this bad boy. You're beautiful, mate. I'm, I'm, I found a true love today. Like, if I buy a car, like, if I buy a, a fair lady in any other game from now on or start using it more often, you know exactly why. Because I fell in love with it on Forza. Oh, my God. I, I, think I've ever fallen, for, I don't think I've ever fallen in love with a car because of Forza before. But today, my friends, is a day in where actually I did. You just hear the boost. I hear you. Mm. Give me the boost. See, I shouldn't be allowed to drive a car like this. Listen to it. It's just screaming. You hear everything just fucking going for its absolute best. I really want to max this thing out, honestly. But I knew it would, I knew it would ruin it if I did. I, I, that's the only thing. I don't want to... Bloody BMW knobs. Anyway, 
I think we shall round off this video here. I have found a new friend today. A friend for a lifetime, if you will. This is amazing. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. It means so much to me. <laughs> I don't know why I'm getting all soppy now, but <laughs> be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you are new, and we'll see you guys in the next video. I need to listen to it again. Peace. <laughs>